Hi guys, you are on warm24.com and today we will do assemble the smartphone Honor 70. First of all, we need to take out the card tray. For this we use a special tool to push out the tray for two SIM cards. The tray is located at the bottom where the charging port. Next, we need to heat the surface of the back cover up to a temperature of approximately 70 Celsius degree or 158 degree Fahrenheit. For this we use a heating mat, you can use a hair dryer. As we can see, the temperature we have is rising to the temperature we need. And after 5 or 7 minutes, we can move on to detach the back cover. To remove the back cover, we use a plastic film. This is protective film from the new display. We insert it into the hole between the middle cover and the back cover and run it along. We always need to be careful around the side buttons and cameras, because there may be cables or camera lenses in this area. And we can open the back cover. We have only the gasket presented on the cover. Ok, we move on to unscrewing the screws at the top. We use a 1.5 mm Phillips screwdriver or hash 3 The screws can be different, so we need to be careful. And the screws are badly magnetic and hard to pull out so we will need the tweezers to get them out. There are a few screws underneath the side gasket. We need to peel back the gasket and remove all of them. As we can see, one of these screws has warranty sticker, which means that no one has disassembled the smartphone before us. We have removed all the screws and we can move on to removing the cover. We pry it at the edges to detach the clips or hooks that hold the cover. Then we can disconnect the two battery connectors with a non-metal tool. And we move on to unscrewing the screws at the bottom. The screwdriver is the same, 1.5mm Phillips screwdriver. The screws are also badly magnetic. It is better to use tweezers to remove them after unscrewing. The screws may be different, so we recommend placing them in a special surface in an order easy to remember for assembly. And we move on to detaching the cover with a speaker. We carefully hook the edge and gently lift it off. We also peel off the protective coating. Now we can disconnect the two connectors of the two coaxial cables. The interboard cable connector and the fingerprint sensor connector. We also need to release the cables from the clamps securing them to the subboard. 
Ok, and we move on to detaching the subboard, hooking it by the edges and pulling it out. The subboard is slightly recessed into the display frame. On the subboard we have a charging port, microphone and on the back side is located the holder for SIM cards. On the bottom we still have the fingerprint sensor and vibration mode. Let's move on to disconnecting the connectors at the top. We disconnect the display connector, the interboard cable connector, two connectors of the two coaxial cables. After that we can detach the rear cameras. First detach the assembly with the two rear cameras and then detach one rear camera. Now we can unscrew the two screws securing the motherboard. Philips H3O or 1.5mm screwdriver. The screws are different, so it is important not to mix them up when reassembling. And now we can detach the front camera. Let's move on to removing the motherboard. Find a convenient place, hook the edges and remove the motherboard. And this is the end of this disassembly. Thank you for watching and see you around. Ok guys, now we're done, thank you for watching, if you like what we do, please consider subscribing to our YouTube channel, read our articles on our website, take care of yourself and until next video.